Speaking of gaming, yeah, this is definitely one area where the Galaxy is superior. This is a very, very solid gaming device. Stuff like this is why I love tech. You can just play whatever you want to play at maximum settings, and the phone is just going to fly through it. The first major upgrade for Samsung's Galaxy S23 Ultra is the performance. It is powered by a brand new processor. This is the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 for Galaxy. So, specially tuned for Galaxy devices for better performance, better gaming. What you can expect is blisteringly fast action and impressive efficiency too. Thankfully, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 can ably handle any game you chuck at it, like Genshin Impact, again on those maxed out detail settings with a perfectly fluid frame rate. It's a large, beautiful screen that looks like it's just a panel of glass that you're holding in your hand. That display goes up to 1,750 nits. Really nice, bright display, which I think is really important when you're gaming. So far, battery has been good and you're getting better performance. So I really, really like that with the uh, Galaxy S23 Ultra. I've been really impressed with the battery life so far. I never struggled to make it through a full day on a single charge. It's going to last you all day, rest assured. So if that's something that you're concerned about, how this phone fares with different games, literally there's nothing to worry about. You're getting a full fledged gaming experience, and dare I say this might set that template for the best gaming phone of the year.